Well, new tonight and a story that has our entire newsroom talking. If you've ever felt the sting of roaming charges on your cell phone bill, then you can relate to what happened to a Dunedin man after he returned from a vacation overseas. This is unbelievable. He made a call for action to our Jackie Calloway after his phone carrier sent a six figure bill. This is one of the views they don't do me de. Rene Romanda and his wife Linda spent three weeks touring Switzerland last September. If you see a picture of that, that's Geneva. That's Lausanne. That's the town that I, I grew up in. Great time in a great location up in the mountains. Rene says he's been with T-Mobile for close to 30 years. He told me he notified the carrier of his travel plans. I said, you'll be, you, you're, you're covered. Whatever that meant, you're covered. The Dunedin couple says they've made multiple trips to Switzerland, where Rene is from, but they've never occurred any shocking cell phone charges until this trip. I get this T-Mobile bill and didn't, you know, bother me very much because I thought I was, I was reading $143. And I'm uh, thinking, oh, that's, that's reasonable. It wasn't until Rene went to pay the bill that he realized the actual amount owed. And I start you know, look at the bill and I'm looking at it and say, excuse me, what's $143,000? Are you guys crazy? T-Mobile charged him for 9.5 gigabytes of data, which is average for one month. But in Renee's case, it was all roaming data. And that cost thousands of dollars each day of his trip. 8,000, 8,000, 7,000. So I called and the girl put me on hold for a while and she says, let me, you know, let me check this out and get back to you. She gets back. Yeah, no, this is a good bill. What do you mean it's a good bill? Well, this is what you owe. You're, you're kidding me. You're crazy. Renee hired an attorney. This is the letter to the president. This is the president of T-Mobile. From your attorney? Yeah. Any response to this? No. And so far, I, was, I spent $2,500 with the attorney. So now you're paying an attorney and you're still not getting anywhere. Yeah, absolutely. Absolutely nowhere. Then Renee's attorney sent me a letter along with a copy of that phone bill asking for help. I contacted T-Mobile's corporate office, let them know that Renee notified the phone company about his travel plans before leaving the country. Days later, someone from T-Mobile called him. Mr. Raymond, we're very sorry that this, you know, that this is the way it went, that, you know, that this happened, blah, blah, blah. Uh, we're going to credit your account for the entire amount. T-Mobile told us in this email, we recommend our customers check the travel features of their plan, such as international data roaming, before departing. If a customer is on an older plan that doesn't include international roaming for data and calling, they'll need to make sure they're using airplane mode and Wi-Fi when using data to be certain the device doesn't connect to an international network. So what was it like to be able to get that from T-Mobile that the charges are dropped? It was a relief. I mean, an absolutely relief. And I think that you're the one who made it happen. Each carrier differs on how it handles roaming charges. The terms are posted on their websites. Be sure to check before your next vacation. Jackie Calloway taking action for you.